up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? It's your boy Kevin to turn on this motherfucking YouTube shit. Hey man, say man, we are lit, eh? Land to my fucking tears, man. Turn, 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 turn. Today, to my fucking day. Jay Hood, no, sorry, Crip shit, man. Hey man, say man, big Crip out here, man. As a black Hebrew Israelite, man. As a Jew, man, we turn, 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 turn. Hey man, say man, thank God, Yahweh, man. Make sure y'all like and subscribe to these videos up, man. We out here for the one time, one time. Turn up with your boy, man. Thank God, man. Out here for another day. Hey man, Sammy, we about to get lit, 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 lit. About to talk to some real deal ish, man. And make sure y'all like and subscribe to these videos. Like, fuck with your boy. Alright, boom. Hey man, Sammy, um, so if y'all did not know, we have made a bunch of videos about T.I. and Boosie, man. So T.I. came out about he snitched on his dead cousins. He said that his, um, his cousin got shot up. And got killed while they was driving, you know what I'm saying? And T.I. had to get on trial and talk about what happened. About the, about a lot of stuff, about a lot of shit. So, you know, T.I. was trying to make a, a, a now he said he, try, he was trying to make a joke. And was saying, yeah, man. He said, ha, 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 ha. Back in the day, you dig? We used to, uh, me and my boy, my cousin, he died. He came back to life. You know what I'm saying? As Casper the Friendly Ghost, you know, I, I seen him fly down to earth. You know what I'm saying? A little boat, 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 tuxedo. He came talk to me. He said, Hey, cuz. Snitch on me, cuz. Snitch on me. Hey, hey, you don't go down. Snitch on me, cuz. Ugly! So his cousin came back from the death, you know what I'm saying? From Underworld. The Undertaker got the nigga said, ha! Bring your ass back! <sighs> now, tell him. I just tell him that it was me, not you, T.I. So T.I. did what he did, you know what I'm saying? They said he said he snitched on his cousin. You know what I'm saying? Now, I don't know if he thought, I don't know what he thought was, bro. I don't know what he thought was going on. Because, nigga, I don't know if he thought he was untouchable. If this nigga thought, you know what I'm saying? He was just like, you know what I'm saying? One of those, one of those ones who couldn't get, like, you know what I'm saying? Fucked up. Hey, nigga. Bruh, you don't know that we was on a, we on a whole snitch trial hunt, nigga. Like, nigga, they was waiting for a dummy to, to say they snitched. Nigga, they was waiting. Nigga, they were literally licking their chops waiting. Like, Rrr. I'm telling you, like, Birdman waiting. Like, Rrr. Rrr. waiting, nigga, waiting for the nigga to come up and start slipping and so they can get on their nigga head. I'm telling y'all, niggas, bro, I already know how it is. They, they, they chops drooling and shit like a piece of steak was right in their face. T.I., you big duck ass, but it's like... Because he already getting investigated. It wasn't it was like that about old people. But like from the hood, you know what I'm saying? He's already investigating his his his, his, his my crime stoppers. You feel me? Crime stoppers was wild. He got caught with with all these guns. You know, he had the blink on him. He had doo -doo -doo -doo, the thukas, all that, all that, the pressure, the piece, the metal. He had it on him. A bunch of them, you know what I'm saying? Turns to find out they was unregistered. You know what I'm saying? So a person he, he said as soon as he got the guns. They popped up on that nigga and, you know, they went to jail. He said the only way he got caught was because with a finger, a finger scan. A finger scan was the only way he got caught. If he did, if he would use the pin code, he wouldn't have got caught. So he said he had to do it. Then nigga said <laughs> he had to do it. You know, I, I fuck with, I fuck with down south too, man. ATL, all that. But he had to do it. Hug <laughs> last. So that, but that nigga, hey, he, that man said, man, if you, if you, if you, if you do a little crime stopper video, man. We give you some pancakes with fat, with fat free, sugar free syrup. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be, the ain't gonna be the, the regular pancake. It's gonna be some type of weak ass, weak, you know what I'm saying? That, that been nasty, that, that they don't have to give the, the scraps to. You know what I'm saying? He, he wasn't gonna get the good shit. He's like, about damn George, you know I'm gonna have to do it. Then he ran, then he ran to it. Then he said, man. So, you know, he did the crime stop. He said, man, if you do this, whoop the whoop. Call Crime Stoppers. Do, 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 do. And the shit is crazy because, look, nigga, they was doing pay rewards to, uh, 
to, to snitch. That's why I said, man, he once started the, the, the ratting in ATL, man. He got to because ain't no way. Now everybody in ATL ratting, bro. Ain't no way, bro. So, you know what I'm saying? He, Boosie called him out because, you know, Boosie is his best friend. You know, his dog, his road dog. His road dog, you know what I'm saying? Friend, son's best friends, all that woo woo. So, you feel me? Crip shit. So, you know what I'm saying? He had, he had to say what he had to say. So, he went on. He went online. He told Vlad, hey, man. If, if, if T.I. snitched on a nigga, it's over. We dead, nigga. Crossed out like that, nigga. Ain't never talked to that nigga again. So T.I. came back and said, man, come on, bro. I thought we was bad in this. I thought we was boys. I'm friend, our son's best friend. Nigga, how you going to say this, whoop the whoop, and you didn't even call me to ask what the fuck happened, what went down. I got the paperwork. But I'm thinking in my, my mind, I'm like, bro, T.I., are you on, did you, are you, are you taking Ritalin? Are you taking motherfucking... Uh, psycho pills, nigga. What the fuck is you taking, nigga? Cause it ain't like, like I said, ain't like, ain't like we were looking at his shit and we just found out about it. Nigga, he literally told us, literally in his fucking video, I snitched on my dead cousin. And I'm like, what the fuck, nigga? So, you know, so he got mad at Boosie trying to pull up. Nigga, if I was bo- if I was Boosie, man, I'd, I'd be laughing at that shit, man. I'm like, T.I., come on, man. No, I'm gonna pull up no dry-ass ATL and the popo's gonna be waiting outside for a nigga. The, 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 the crib might be um all types of speakerphone guy, you know what I'm saying? Hitting cameras, all types of shit, you know what I'm saying? Who knows what the guy, the boy waiting out in the back or some shit. You know, weird shit, you feel me? Cause there ain't no way I'm going down to just sit, to just see that dumb ass shit. Cause you already, so why would you, why would you even have paperwork in the first place? You know what I'm saying? If you didn't do nothing, you want if you didn't do nothing, you, you wouldn't need no paperwork to show if you snitched or not, right? You know what I'm saying? So all oh, that is no avoid, no the no the boy, cause you don't need no you don't need no paperwork to see if you snitched. Alright, we get we get you by your words, you didn't snitch. But you try to have a joke about snitching, you know everybody in the motherfucking world is going down for snitching, going to jail. And we we trying to see who's the rats who snitching on everybody. You just said you was a snitch. Now you say he's a joke. But I just seen another interview where it says Boosie. Boosie said, Ain't no way we ever friends after this, bro. Ain't no way, man. Um because he said too much shit keep on happening, man. At first, he said he said his name already been smushed, he, and he, but he let that go because he said he thought it was like some type of like you know what I'm saying some type of like you know he was trying to trick the niggas like oh yeah I do this shit, but at the end of the day, nigga, I ain't fuck with y'all niggas. You know what I'm saying on some shit like that. But the but the shit is weird because he actually like he went on crime stoppers and he told these niggas like you know what I'm saying whoop the whoop and you feel me and they got my um call in you get a, a pay reward. You get money, money. You get money for snitching on niggas, bro. So you know these niggas, you know these got these informers getting eighty k fucking a month, nigga. Niggas can't barely make eighty k in a fucking year, nigga. These niggas get eighty k a month, nigga. <laughs> Wild shit. So you know, oh, it's eighty k a month or eighty k a year. I think it's eighty k a month a year. One of them. I think it's eighty k a month. But it's just wild, man. So it's like, you know what I'm saying? These niggas out here be snitching. Weak ass niggas, you know what I'm saying? People be weak, people be weak out here, you know what I'm saying? Ain't, ain't nobody be solid. Everybody running their mouths. Everybody trying to get the cheese. You get a real street nigga like me, you know what I'm saying? But niggas be snitching, you know what I'm saying? And so, I, that's why I stay low key, you know what I'm saying? You feel me? So, um, but yeah, like, so, like, so T.I., he, he snitched on his own self. Now, that's bad snitching. That's real bad snitching. Like, you don't snitch on your whole self on a federal case type shit, you know what I'm saying? So, and then Boosie's like, Boosie, ain't no fucking way, ain't no fucking way, nigga, we, we, we ever, like, getting back together on some Lincoln shit with, with the labels and shit, making music, because he said, you just tarnished the whole name, how would, how do you expect a nigga, like a nigga like Boosie, to go on a, a, a song or an album about T, with T.I., and the whole time you think thinking, like, damn, didn't T.I. just snitch? All these goddamn time, how can you take this nigga serious half the time? You know what I'm saying? So it's weird. It's like, damn, man, T.I., you just really fucked it up. You know what I'm saying? And like I said, man, if I was boosting and, and T.I. was like, and T.I. said, pull up. I'll be like, hell no. Nah. 12 at your, 12 already at your crib. In your, in your closet, under your um sink, trying to um, listen to what niggas say. So it's like, nigga, you be a dummy to, to you know what I'm saying, to, to go up here and shit. Now I heard that 50 Cent was talking and shit, so you know what I'm saying, that's weird shit. Um, you know, Boosie, you know, 50 Cent's always, I, you know, I, I fuck with 50 Cent's, man, but it's like 50 Cent's always got something to say, bruh, Fifty Cent's always got something to say, man, like, nigga, you already making a billion dollars, nigga, why the fuck y'all in niggas business and shit, like, the fuck?
Uh, I've been looking at what he said, man. Oh, he just, oh, he's just making fun of it, man. He just, he just, he just, he, he really just instigating the shit. Fifty Cent just instigating, you know what I'm saying? We just like, you know what I'm saying? Making them niggas get mad at each other and shit. But I feel like, man, Fifty Cent, mind your business, man. Y'all already making millions, niggas. This some, this some real deal ish. There ain't no time to make jokes about, you know what I'm saying? Niggas snitching and shit, man. I feel like Fifty Cent just be trying to get into. Just drama and shit and instigate and shit. Man, if you ain't about to do like pull up to what they doing or some shit like 50 cents, you know what I'm saying? Just, just, why the fuck you even in this shit? Like it makes no sense half the time, man. That like, people be jumping themselves into this shit. Like this nigga a millionaire, billionaire nigga. We the public. We the people who listen to this, this shit, man. Ain't no fucking way you should be jumping into this, this situation when we trying to handle some street business, you know what I'm saying? Even though you're a street nigga, you know what I'm saying? But still at the end of the day, man. Let the, let the streets handle it, bro. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man, so... At the end of the day, man, so we're gonna see what's gonna happen between uh, T.I. and Boosie, man. I feel like they ain't finna just... They ain't finna... Um, they ain't finna be friends no more, man. So, at the end of the day, man, it's tough, man. You know, if they... You know, they, they can't... Like, Boosie stand on principle, man, on ten toes. So, it's like, hey, you did what you did. You're gonna have to help. You got to hold the hold consequences, man. 50 cents, man. I'm gonna look back deeper into this man and see what you're saying. I'm gonna, put, I'm gonna still put you in the title. Like 50 Cent's jumping on the do 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 do. Head ass. But yeah, 50 Cent, you just. I don't know why you try to make jokes again. You uh, you, you gonna joke about. You gonna joke about you snitched, man? It's about time. Is it, you about to say you, you snitched? Let's find out 50 Cent, man. But, hey, man, so make sure you like and subscribe to the video, man. We out the bitch hood and outside crib shit. And yeah, we out the bitch gang. Do this, man. I'm about to get these videos out for y'all. Hey, Dad, you know what I when we link up, dog. This shit be legendary. You know this is instrumental. You the engineer on it, so. Kodak everywhere.